Hey, welcome to Quality of Life, New Covenant Grace Teaching Ministry. Um, my wife and I would like to be an encouragement to you. We're uh, speaking today about law and grace. What does that mean? Um, first of all, we live in a New Covenant time, um, and I'm going to explain what that means. First of all, I want to go to Hebrews. Um, we're going to go to Hebrews chapter 10, um, verses 9. And I'm going to read Hebrews 10, verses 9. Then he says, Here I am, I have come to do your will. He does away with the first to establish the second. Um, Law was Old Covenant, and the law, Old Covenant, is a self-sufficient covenant. Um, it's man reaching up to God um, through self-effort in hopes of gaining his love and acceptance and his right standing with God. Um, of course, the New Covenant is where God reaches down to man um, with love and acceptance, um, through faith in Jesus Christ. And so, um, what this is going to mean is grace is going to be about trusting Christ. And, uh, and so, what we're going to discover there in the second part of verse 9, Hebrews 10, 9, is he does away with the first, uh, meaning he does away with the old covenant in order to establish the new covenant. And so, to make it very simple, um, we're no longer under a, a covenant uh, that says we need to trust ourselves and pull up our bootstraps. But as born-again believers in Christ, as new creatures in Christ, through faith in Christ, um, led by the Spirit means to just, we trust that Christ took all our sins away at the cross. We trust that in Him we are given the right to be called children of God. Um, through the Holy Spirit's uh, placing us in Christ. Um, before Christ, we were spiritually dead, but when the Holy Spirit placed us born-again believers in Christ, we were made alive spiritually, and this, of course, made us new creatures in Christ. Um, now, we, we um, trust um, God's love for us, our Father, um, that we are always clean and in right standing, um, in His presence, and so we're always loved and accepted uh, by our Heavenly Father as His children. Now, of course, the Holy Spirit is living on the inside of every born-again believer, and we believe the Holy Spirit is the Comforter, the Encourager, the Advocate, and the Holy Spirit renews the mind so we can be transformed. And so, <clears throat> this has been uh, law and grace, so we're no longer under the, the law, of uh, the Old Covenant law, which was the Old Covenant, it was between God and the nation and people of Israel, um, that has been canceled. Um, and so, the New Covenant is here. Um, and so, that's between God the Father and the followers of Christ Jesus. So, I just wanted to be an encouragement to you and uh, just kind of share with you the difference between law and grace. Law, again, I will say, it's just trusting self-sufficiency. And uh, grace, again, is just trusting Christ. Thank you. And uh, remember, you're the most important person here because without you, we could not teach. And also, we learn so we can teach and we teach so we can learn. Um, from my wife and myself and Quality of Life Ministries, we would just like to thank you and say God bless. Have a great day.